the secret door. So what seems to have just been your empty underground house is now some type of crazy evil planning hacker's lair. This brand new Brookhaven secret is actually amazing and I bet none of you guys know about this secret location. To go and get to our first secret location that is brand new and just came out in a recent update, you will want to go and get yourself a house. So you'll click on the house menu button on the right hand side and click on this house right here which has a yellow top. As you can now see, we have gone and selected that house and we're going to go on inside and show you the secret location. It's actually really cool and trust me, you guys are going to love it. So once we're in the house, you'll notice that there are two steps of staircases. I mean, you can go up, but the thing we want to do is go down these staircases. So down here we have what seems to be just an ordinary looking library, we can turn the lights on or whatnot. And yeah, it just looks like a normal library, but believe it or not, one of these bookshelves is actually a top secret hiding room. What? That is so cool. So let's go and see if we can find out which one is a secret door. So the first thing you can do is just kind of hide in this one. This one's not like the secret door. You can just kind of hide in it though in case you want to just, you know, spy on someone. You can kind of do that from here. So you could be spying on them, just staring. And they wouldn't be able to tell that you're looking because like you're hidden here and you can see what is about to go and happen. But that that's not the secret, guys. Trust me, it gets a whole, a whole ton better. So we're going to go and check out what the secret room is. To go and activate this secret room, believe it or not, you got to push a secret button. So we're going to try and locate that button. Alright, so on one of these wooden pillars is actually a top secret new button that will go and activate you your top secret room. So it's not this one. Oh, I think I found it. Normally you can tell when you found a secret button is because your arrow, like your where your cursor is, turns from a little pointy triangle into a click button. So once I click this button, it's going to go and take me into the secret room. So let's go and do it in 3, 2, 1, let's go! I kid you not, a magic door just opened and closed on me. And if you want to open it from the other side, then there you go. That is the secret door. You want more proof? Click it again and it opens and then it will go and close on you. You guys can go and check this out for yourself by going and actually doing this in the game. So you're probably questioning, oh, it's just like more boring bookshelves, right? No, there is actually now a staircase, well, a ramp which will take you down into this darkened room with pillars and it starts to get even more creepy. So what seems to have just been your empty underground house in your basement is now some type of crazy evil planning hacker's lair. We have a set of six chairs. Nope, we have a set of five chairs. I clearly can't count. And you can just kind of sit in them. We've got some eerie looking lighting. Like these lights look pretty spooky to me. And then over here, there is just another table and a book. I'm not sure what's on the book. Um, just a, a, a stand maybe. I don't know what that is. But yeah, this is looking like we're holding some evil meeting right here. And like all of these people, we're like planning to rob the bank or something in Brookhaven. I feel like that is what this place is going to be used for. Like some roleplay with like, ha ha ha, we should rob the bank everyone. Ha ha ha, that's definitely what they're going to do. Uh, yeah, let me know if you're going to use this one. It's pretty cool secret location. I'm not sure what's in the corner. Is this like a, a tree? I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't look very healthy. It literally looks like a black blob. Please water your plants. Whoever this is, uh, you better sort that out. So let's go and show you how to escape. Simply walk up these steps. Click on the neon yellow button. It will go and activate your door. And you are now out of this room. Let's jump right into the second secret. Simply go and get yourself a vehicle to make sure that you're going and uh, traveling to the place faster. And what we want to be going and doing is heading to this auto shop. And in this auto shop is a relatively recent update. Some of you guys may know this one, but if you don't, then you guys are in luck. 
simply go and head on in into this area right here and as you can see there is a broom you click on this broom and it activates a secret gate which allows you to go and drop down to escape go and push that button and you can go and get back in so down from here you've got a secret evil hackers layer with like spy cameras uh some lovely looking black things which we can't say will we'll get demonetized <laughs> and uh, some evil bandana and like hacking area so this is a pretty cool looking layer so let's go and check out the next one so for this next hack you're going to go and need to change your home to this one and press choose selected house it's gonna now go and load us in a brand new house so if you didn't know there is a bunch of secrets in each house and while we wait for that house to load i'm gonna go and show you a secret in the police station in case you don't know this one or you haven't seen my old video simply run up these steps on the top and there is actually a little um gap through here you jump up through and you're in the vent you jump up through and you're in the vent and then there is a secret door against the wall which will go and give you a secret key so just walk up against the wall walk to the right and so now you're in this secret room if you go behind here you can go and grab a blue key card which will go and give you access to a another secret room in brookhaven this blue key card goes and unlocks this room in case you want to go and use it or just flick some switches and if you want to go and use the password your username is the password so this is my house that we have just gone and loaded in and what you want to go and do is actually run up these stairs so once you're at the top of these we can see that we have a nice loving looking bedroom type of area what we want to do is go straight into this building which has a nice bed it's got a little office and what we want to do is open up our backpack scroll down until you go and see the ladder so what you need is this ladder which you will go and place so this red step ladder and then what you go and do is actually go and click on it and what you want to do is try and place it in the top right corner just above this so if you look up we will see that there is a white panel so this is kind of like a secret attic to go and get into so this that little panel right up there um is actually the thing we're gonna try and get into so i'm gonna try point at it can you guys see that right there where my finger is pointing that's what we're gonna try and get into so you then need to jump up onto the top oh there's a this is a perfect example and then you jump up onto here and uh the person below me is gonna be so confused where i literally just disappeared to oh they're trying to jump up they're trying to get to me oh oh no what are they saying um help 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 okay well they they need help um well that's great <laughs> okay so when we're up here there's actually a bunch of cool secret things so let's go and jump back up um if it lets us to so jump into here then jump up the top and we have a secret looking artifact okay so this is like a glowing crystal and i don't know what this thing is it kind of looks like a chair kind of thing then over here we have this and it's just full of hashtags and again it's a glowing pyramid so there is two glowing pyramids up here and some weird looking like hostage chair kind of thing like i'm not too sure what this is it kind of looks like some weird experiment maybe brookhaven forgot to remove this but i mean they deliberately left this panel here um I, I don't know what poor old angela's doing right now i i have no clue <laughs> apparently they're a police officer um so oh my light is gone as well i i guess they are role playing because you know that's probably what you're meant to do in this game i just don't normally see people okay now why are there two people here like i, I just said you could have my house i'm gonna leave uh okay so i i guess we're just gonna let them people have fun i mean they literally own my house now so um pfft. have fun with it i hope they look after my house well what is this why is there a a demon baby watching me right now why are there two demon babies what in the world are they about to mug me what are you kidding what is happening um i feel like this is like some trap and there is two little demons watching me but anyway, that's it for today's video. Um, I hope you enjoy. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.